Now we are going to do important chapter maximum and minimum of application of derivative. Now see what is maximum, what is minimum. Let f be a real valued function in AB. If c belongs to AB and fc greater than or equal to fx, then c is called maxima. fc is greater than or equal to fx, so fc will be maximum. Like that graph. In this graph, you see that this is the highest point. This one, so this length is c, that is maxima, and this is maximum. If fc is less than or equal to x, then c is called minima, and fc is called minimum. Here you see this in this graph. This is the shortest length, shortest distance from x-axis. So this length is c is called minima, and this length is called minimum. Now, first derivative test of this. How to test one function is maximum or minimum. If f dash x is zero to closely left of c, that is before c, f f dash x is positive, and f dash x less than zero to closely right of c, that is f dash x is negative after c, then f c is maximum. F dash just opposite thing. F dash x less than zero for closely right of c, and f dash x greater than zero. to closely right of c that is before c it is negative before after c it is positive then it is fc is minimum if f dash x does not change its sign then it is called neither maximum nor minimum and this is called c is called point of inflection now second derivative test if f dash c is 0 and double dash if it is negative if negative then maximum if positive double derivative then it is minimum positive minimum negative maximum if double derivative is zero then test will remember one thing first derivative always zero for maximum or minimum point now if it is closed interval then suppose f is a function differentiable function on closed interval ab and c belongs to closed interval ab f dash c is equal to 0 because at the maximum or minimum point first ab should be 0 then maximum of f a f b f c gives the maximum value called absolute maximum minimum value among this three is called absolute minimum value now exercise 6.5 first question if we do find the maximum or minimum values if exist fx is given as this one so given fx is this if we differentiate this one it is our rule procedure to de first derivative we have to calculate this derivative will give 2 into twice x minus 1 and differentiation of 3 is 0 if we take first derivative is 0 then this term will be 0 So twice x minus one equal to zero gives x equal to half. This x equal to half can be called max, maxima or minima according to the f f half is maximum or minimum. Now second derivative if we do that is if we differentiate this one it will be d dx of two twice x minus one. Differentiation of this will give if we multiply four x four x differentiation is four. And if we withdraw this bracket minus two, so differentiation is zero. Four is a positive for any values of x. So by second derivative test, if we put x as half, then it will be minimum. Minimum because positive it is minimum, and value of x is called minima. Then minimum value of f is f half. If we put half in this one. Then we will get as f half is three, which is called minimum values. 